The Blitzstriker Amphitheater will be the second DLC for Day of Dragons and will launch in the 1.0 update. In this video, the devs have given me permission to showcase some early animations and I will also be going over what sort of gameplay style you might expect. Keep watching till the end to find out how to play it for free or maybe even win yourself a copy of the DLC. The Blitzstriker is an Amphitheater, which means two wings, and is completely legless. In history, the winged serpent has been used in European heraldry. Comparable to the shadow scale in size, the Blitzstriker has a lower profile and less overall body mass, and has a very eel-like body shape. It is slow on the ground, moving in a serpentine manner, as its wings are not really designed for walking. However, it is completely at home in the air and will be spending most of its time flying through the clouds and soaring high looking for unsuspecting dragons. Taking the Amp in Amphitheater to the most literal sense, the Blitz, which means lightning in German, has a lightning breath attack as well as a special electromagnetic pulse attack to stun other dragons for a short time. This can be used as an escape mechanism on the ground, giving the Blitz the extra time it needs to launch to the air with a leap not needing a running start, or in the air as a hunting aid to stun flying dragons and send them crashing to the ground, weakening them enough to take them out with a final strike. Bio dragons, hatchlings and the future Zygov will need to be especially careful around the Blitz, as the EMP is an area effect, and a tiny stunned dragon is able to be instantly swallowed and eaten. Thankfully, its slow speed on the ground should mean such sized dragons can keep their distance as long as they're watching out. My personal speculation, and this is not confirmed, is that the Blitz could be a great swimmer, and make use of its EMP to stun fish for an easy meal. Nesting will always be risky, but especially for the Blitzstriker, requiring it to be on the ground. However, their smaller size and planned future ability to cling to certain surfaces with those powerful claws will likely make the Electric Noodle able to find nesting locations that would be inaccessible to most of the dragons. While not confirmed, I would not be surprised if the Blitzstriker hatchlings were able to fly soon after birth. Either that, or they will likely be able to achieve powered flight much sooner than other hatchlings, as its slow ground movement will leave it very vulnerable until it's able to get in the air. I do get the feeling that the Blitz could have a slow food drain, much like a snake and other reptiles, not needing to feed as often as other dragons. Whether this is true or not, we will have to wait till the 1.0 update to find out. The DLC is currently now available to purchase on the Day of Dragons website, links in the description, and is currently discounted, but just like with the Acid Spitter Drake, you do not need to have the DLC to play the Blitz. Just look out for a nest willing to invite you in, and not only will you get to play as a dragon for free, but you will likely hatch with much better stats than any fresh spawn. If however you would like to spawn as a Blitzstriker Amphitheer, you're in luck. I have 5 keys to give away to my subscribers. Simply post a comment below with the word Spark Snake in it. I will be picking a winner for a code from this video and announce it in the next Day of Dragons video, and then have the next code to give away in that video. I will keep doing this until all of the codes have been given away, so make sure you're subscribed to know as soon as a new video is uploaded. It won't just be the Blitzstriker keys I'll be giving away after all. Good luck, and see you soon!